Okay, I need this. I need this too. Almost forgot this shirt. Oh no, I'm not ready. Okay, that's it. Uh, uh, close. Come on, close. Uh, come on, fit in there. Mm. Stop panicking, Tina. Why do you need so many clothes? What do you mean many? There's just a few. Mm, come on, close. <laughs> Your suitcase won't even close. So help me. Uh, fine. Come on! Oh, well, you ready, sisters? Ah, uh, almost. We can't close the suitcase of our rich sis. What? <laughs> and why do you need so many clothes? That's what I said. We're moving just for one week and only next door. So what? These clothes can only be enough for two days. I've got this. You can live a year with what's in there. Mm, how do I close it? I'll help you. Oh. Yeah. What's going on? Why are you sitting around? We're already packed. See? Then go. My plane's in an hour. Go ahead. Your dad is already waiting for you at his place. Do we have to go to dad's? Yeah. Can we just live here alone? Oh, no. I had enough last time. So this to dad's. But mom! Come on, go, go. Girls, finally you're here. Hello, Hello dad. dad. Yeah, hi. I've been waiting for you. I missed you so much, my dear girls. We really missed you too. Stop it, dad. We're not little anymore. Um, where are our rooms? I hope we'll have the most expensive one as usual. Oh, I have to get to work. Hope you can figure it out yourself. See you. Mm-hmm. Missed us so much that he bolted right away. Jeez. I'll check out my room. No, I will. Am I the last one? Wait. What? There are, there are only, only two, two beds? beds? I call top bunk. I call bottom bunk. And me? Where will I sleep? You, as always, on cardboard. <laughs> <laughs> no fair. I want the top bunk. Nobody asked you. But girls, why are there two beds? Let's build a triple bunk bed. Build it? Well, yeah. Wait. Oh, done. And what's this? Construction plan. Yikes, I won't build anything. I just got a manicure. But girls, I don't want to sleep on cardboard. Fine. Don't start. We'll deal with this after school. Uh, I hate school. Let's go. <gasps> wow, what a gorge bouquet. I wonder who it's from. From me. Tina, good job. Bouquets are more and more beautiful every time. <laughs> Do you give yourself flowers? <laughs> and what's so funny? I just want to make myself happy. Trying to make up for not having a boyfriend who'd give you flowers? <laughs> oh, please, you don't have either, boyfriend or bouquet. <laughs> Actually, I have a boyfriend. <laughs> who is he? The invisible guy? <laughs> He's not invisible. He's very real and very handsome. Yeah, right. Like, I believe you. He really does exist. Okay, let's go to class, dreamer. <laughs> My love. I'm so glad to see you again. Oh, stop it. We only didn't see each other over the weekend. Oh, look, our lovebirds. Shh, let's watch. <laughs> These two days seemed like eternity. Oh, come on. Uh, I have a gift for you. Cardboard flower? Uh-huh. It will never fade. You don't even have to water it. Wow, you're so smart. <laughs> Cardboard flower, this is hilarious. <laughs> <is> so cringe. <laughs> ah, why are you laughing? Unlike you two, I have a boyfriend. I have a boyfriend too. <laughs> you? A boyfriend? <laughs> Imaginary, right? I'm so sick of you. He's real. Yeah, right. We believe you, we do. <laughs> 
Oh, I'm so tired after school. Hey, get out of my bed. Why is it yours? It's my bed. Girls, maybe we should really build the third bed, or these fights will never end. Whoa! Wow. Tina, Tina had, had a, a smart, smart idea. idea. Ugh, let's build it already. Ah, phew. They're so heavy. Do we really need that many boards? Of course. Okay, put it over there. Over here? No, to your right. Phew. Why am I even carrying these boards? I'm the brains behind the construction. No one but me will understand this plan. That's true. But where's Tina? I can't believe it. She's sleeping. Wake up! Huh? What? Get up! Why are you helping us? For what? I'll sleep on the top bunk and you do what you gotta do. Tina! Girls, what's going on here? We're building a bed. You forgot that you have three daughters. There's actually another room. Two of you can sleep here and one in the room next door. Didn't I tell you? Separate room? It's, it's mine. mine. Stop! It's a room for me! For me! Yes, I got here first. Mia, please, can I stay here? Nope. I'm sleeping here. No, no, and no. I got here first. So beat it. The room is mine. But Mia! Okay, I call the top bunk. Hey, the top bunk is mine! Ah, oh, finally. I'll take a break from them. Awesome. Ah. Oh. Tina, you're here too. What you doing? Eating a salad? Can't you see? Yeah, you're right. Hmm, how are you? Hey, what do you want? Um, well, nothing. Cindy. Well, I wanted to ask you for some money. You wish. Get lost. But Tina, pretty please? I can show you a trick. A trick? Wait. If I make these tomatoes disappear, you'll give me money. This is silly. How will you do it? Look. Unbelievable! How did you do that? Magician secret. Give me cash. Okay. Whoa! You gave Cindy money? She showed such a sick trick. You'll love it. All right. I want to see too. There. There. See? It's called magic. You are so naive. Look. She's just hiding a tomato in a cup. Uh, you liar. Give me back my money. Oh, you're all here. Great. Did something happen, Dad? I just realized that I know very little about your lives and hobbies. Plus, I would like to meet your boyfriends. After all, I have to know who my daughters are dating. It's a good idea, Dad, but I'm the only one with a boyfriend. I'm so sick of you. I'm tired of telling you. I have a boyfriend too, and I'm going on a date with him. Lying? Lying. <laughs> Interesting. Mmm, stop littering. You want me to throw wrappers on my bed? Well, not on mine. Oh, back off. You'll clean it up. I have a better idea. Ah, uh, that's what I need. And what did you bring? Pass protection. Like this? Mm-hmm. Okay, okay. Yes, I think it will be great. Ah, oh, legit. Now I'm not afraid of any rappers. Got it, Tina? Uh-huh. Listen, we should go check on Mia. What if she's really with a guy? Hmm, why not? If she was so mad, maybe he is a real person, not her imagination. And where is she? Oh, there she is. As I thought, she's all alone. Let's go talk to her. What a nice date you're having. And your boyfriend is such a cutie. <laughs> what are you doing here? Meeting, Meeting your, your boyfriend. boyfriend. Who you talked <sighs> so much about. Turns out he's not here. <laughs> <laughs> he's just running late. 
Yeah, well, we'll wait. Mia, can you stop lying? It's obvi there's no boyfriend. Yeah, let's go home. He's just late because of practice. He'll be here. Mia, you've tried all the drinks here already. Let's go. <gasps> Hello. Hello. Sorry, I'm late. This is my apology. Oh, it's okay, my love. Mia, who is this? Girls, meet my boyfriend, Chris. This is your boyfriend? Chris, these are my sisters, Tina and Cindy. Mia told me so much about you. Nice to meet you. I can't believe it. This handsome guy is your boyfriend? Is something wrong? Tina, come on, we gotta go. Tina, let's go. Yeah, let's go. Jeez, how can that handsome guy date Mia? Not that handsome. My Zach is a hundred times better. Maybe she just asked him to pretend to be her boyfriend, but really they're not together. I doubt it. You can see it in his eyes that he loves her. Oh man, how could Mia get him and not me? Whoa, are you jealous? Um, I'm not jealous. Just, just surprised. Well, okay. Listen, can you follow them? Why me? Well, you need money. So much cash. Wow, I could buy so many books. So what? I can't take it. Are you sure? You're making me follow my sister. Made me take the money? Oh, go already. You'll tell me everything they did. Uh-huh. Wow, Cindy, you're such a good host. Bon appetit. Mmm, so good. You're the best. Mm-hmm. You finished already? So fast? I'm just so hungry. Oh, what's there? Where? Uh, I don't see anything. I must be seeing stuff. Why are you still here? You have to keep an eye on Mia and Chris. What? Right away? I can't do it now. I have a date with Zach. What date? What did I pay you for? Because you love me. Cindy! They're walking in the park. What can happen there? Mm, you can't count on anyone. I'll have to do it myself. Mia! Chris? Where are those lovebirds? Oh, I see them. Oh no, they're about to kiss. Hello. Tina, what are you doing here? Well, just got bored and decided to join you. You don't mind? Of course not. Well, great. Maybe you should go home or get a mani, huh? Nah, I just got a mani yesterday. <laughs> Girls, want to go to the movies? Yes. No, we'll stay here and no one will bother us. As you wish, dear. Thank you, my dear. You're my most beautiful girl in the world. No, you're the most handsome guy in the world. <clears throat> can you stop doing it in front of me? I'm sick of it. If you don't like something, you can just leave. It's okay, I'll take a walk with you later. That's it, this is the end. What happened? Can you imagine? I offered Zach to read my favorite mystery novel, and he said it was nonsense. He only reads science fiction. Gee, I thought it was something serious. This is serious. We don't have the same taste. This is the end. Oh, <laughs> well, my date got ruined today. Is it cause of Tina? So she did find you in the park? She did. Wait, how do you know? Well... Did you tell her? You can't be mad at me. I have a broken heart. Mmm. Mia? Don't. Oh. Mia? Oh, come here, you snitch. Ah, help me. Stop. Let me go. She's a traitor. Wait, Mia. 
Tina told me that you have a boyfriend. I do? So what? Um, just turns out he's a bully, disrupts classes, bullies younger kids. What? It's nonsense. Why nonsense? It's true. Oh, I see. It's your antics. Oh, come here. Mia, it's not your sister's fault. She's just worried about you. But, Dad, she's lying. Chris is a good guy. Yeah? Then invite him over. Let's meet him. Today? Can we do it tomorrow? Right now. So you're that, Chris. Yes, nice to meet you, Mr. Eric. Not really. I heard you're a bad influence on my daughter. Dad! Quiet. I'm talking to your boyfriend. No, I'm an A student. I do sports and... Stop lying! Dad, Chris brought you a cake. With strawberries? Decided to poison me? Huh? I'm allergic to strawberries. Sorry, Mr. Eric. I didn't know. Get out of here. I never want to see you with my daughter again. And you are grounded. <laughs> oh, why are you crying? Did dad kick out your boyfriend? <laughs> Go away. It's all because of you. Chris will be better off with me. What? You want to steal him? Yep. Such a handsome guy. Can't be with you. Chris is my boyfriend and you won't take him away. We'll see about that. Adios, loser. Where are you going? To comfort your Chris. And you have fun being grounded. <laughs> <laughs> and why did you drag me here? To talk to Chris. Why do you need me? I don't want him to suspect anything. You know, we came together worried about our sister. Ah, got it. Hey, hey Chris. Chris. Hi, why are you here? Um, we're worried about you. I mean, about Mia. She's so upset. Me too. I have no idea why your dad got so mad. Yeah, who knows? He must have a vivid imagination. Don't worry, it will pass. I hope so. He just has to like me. Um, do you want to go for a walk? Clear your head? No thanks. I'm not in the mood. We'll help you make sure our dad likes you. Let's exchange numbers to keep in touch. Good idea. Mia's lucky to have sisters like you. Yeah, especially Tina, sister of the year. Well, I gotta go. See you. Yes, now I have his number. We gotta go too, Cindy. Oh, look, we almost forgot. It's not ours. Oh, almost stole it. <laughs> Cindy, hello. Back off, Zach. I don't want to talk to you. Uh, forgive me. I read your book. Really? Yes, and I really liked it. I'm sorry. I was wrong about mystery novels. I'm so glad. You owe me a short recap. What if you're lying? Well, that's it. And now Chris doesn't know how to make peace with our dad. Yeah, so much has happened. All in one day. Uh-huh. When will you introduce me to your dad? You? Why would you want that? I don't think I should. Are you ashamed of me? You said I'm better than Chris. So Mr. Eric will like me. You think Cindy's dad will like me? Tell us in the comments below. Well, it's still so early. Maybe some other time. Yeah, you'll find more excuses later. Call or not. Oh, geez, what if Mia hears me? Oh, whatever. Hi, what's up, Chris? Hello. I got an idea how to make peace between you and dad. Really? Tina, you're the best. You gotta come to our house right away. Yeah, yeah, I'll be right there. Just don't forget flowers have to be roses. Okay, okay, noted. Thanks, Tina. See you. Hey, were you talking to my Chris? Are you nuts? I'm just throwing a party. Decided to invite Chris too. This is interesting. And why did you invite him? So that you could meet. You could say thank you, so ungrateful. Hmm, like I'd believe her. She asked him for her, for sure, snake.
Finally, you're here. Tina's already... I mean, Mia's already waiting for you. And where is she? Um, waiting in a room. It's right down the hall. You can't get lost. Uh, there? Mm-hmm. <sighs> Finally, we're together again. Thanks for the flowers. Chris? Mia, you got it all wrong. I didn't see her face and thought it was you. Stop making excuses, dear. Time to tell her about our relationship. We don't have a relationship. She's lying. I came to see you. And that's why you brought my favorite flowers? Chris would never lie to me. It's all you. You set it up. Uh, no. Uh, why uh, are you yelling? What's going on here again? Hello. You again? I told you not to come here. How dare you? Sneak into my daughter's room. I can explain everything. Let's go. Dad, let him go. I have enough problems already. My car broke down. And now you. I can help with the car. I know cars. You know cars? Yes. Chris's parents own an auto repair shop. Fine. Let's see what your boy can do. Whew. That's it, Mr. Eric. Fixed it. Hmm. Good. You're not as bad as I thought. I told you, Chris is very smart. All right, then. You can date. But don't be out late. Yay! Yay! Thank you, Daddy. Thank you for forgiving me, Mr. Eric. Just don't hurt my daughter. Or else. Got it, got it. So great. Everything worked out. And I can keep dating Chris. Right, Tina? Uh-huh. Just perfect. What's wrong, Tina? Something happened? Nothing. She just wanted Chris to... Zip it, Cindy. Or not just rappers will end up on your bed. Listen, you want to go to the amusement park all together? Chris can come too. I would love to. Great idea, Dad. Well, I'm so glad we'll be spending time with our daddy again. Oh, it must be for me. I'll go open it. Wait, wait. I'll do it. Um, Dad, can I? Dad? Uh, good afternoon. We didn't order pizza. Goodbye. Dad, wait. This is my boyfriend, Zach. This is your boyfriend? Mm-hmm. Nice to meet you, Mr. Eric. These are for you. Good for eyesight. It must be for Cindy. She has vision problems. If she chose you as a boyfriend. Um, how about um, some tea to toast us finally meeting, so to speak? Well, come on in. What else are we gonna do? Knock, knock. It's me. Valerie? Mom, why are you so early? My business trip ended early. So tell the sisters to get ready. We're going home. Can we stay with Dad a little longer? No. But the girls and I had plans. We wanted to go to the amusement park this weekend. Another time, Eric. And now I'm taking my daughters. You look awful, by the way. Uh-huh. Not as awful as you. Um, what about tea? And meeting your dad? Another time, Zach. We have family business. But, um, but... I knew she'd come up with an excuse. It's okay. I'll be back. Cause she was